Hi fellow DIYers! Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new. In this video, I'll be showing you how to make a name keychain using the Dollar Tree Faux Letter Tote Bag. It's only $1.50 each here in Canada. The size of each bag is approximately 9.5 inches by 11 inches, and I like how you can make several keychains out of one bag. I got the keychain ring or book ring off Amazon. I put the link in my description box. So let's get started! Open your Design Space app, click Text, type in your chosen name or text. When choosing a font, make sure it is really thick and simple because we want our keychain to be more durable. In this case, I used Rianti. You can get this font from thefont.com. I'm going to click Advanced, then Ungroup to Letters. Now we can drag and drop them in order to connect each letter. We want to make sure that they are all well connected. And here, since this name has an I, we need to connect the dot of the I to the letter. Click Shapes, and then choose the circle. We have to slice the dot of the I, put the circle on top of it, and then select All, and then click Slice. Now we can delete this too, and just leave that one, and make it bigger, and connect it to the letter. Then select All, and then Weld. Then click Duplicate. Now we're going to create a connector. So click Shapes, and then click Square. Then click Unlock. Then adjust the size to approximately half inch. And then align it to the center and left part of the name. And then select all and then weld. Then click this one. Then click flip. And then flip horizontal. Now we have to align and connect them together. So select all. Then click align. Then center vertically. You can also do align bottom as long as they are centered. Select All, and then click Weld. Now I'm going to resize it to approximately 8 inches, but you can resize it according to your preference or depending on the size of your leather. So the finished product size for this one will be approximately 4 inches because we're going to fold it in half. Click Make It, and then click Continue. Here, I'm using Cricut Explore Air 2, and I have the full letter paper thin saved on my favorites. If you don't, just click Browse All Materials, type in full leather, and then click it. And I always adjust the pressure to more. I'll be using a deep cut blade, but according to Cricut recommendation to use fine point blade. So this is the full letter bag that I'll be using to make the keychain. So I'll be using a new green mat or the standard grip mat because I don't have the purple one. It is recommended to use a purple mat when cutting a faux leather. Face the leather upside down. Then use a brayer if you have one. I love mine because it helps my material to lay flat quicker and easier. I'm putting tapes on the sides because I'm only using a green mat and I want to make sure I have extra grip. I'll be using this keychain ring 
and I got this from Amazon. I put the link in my description box. I'll be using a hot glue on this one. I would suggest to put hot glue one letter at a time. Then go nice and slow and align each letter one at a time. And there we have it! If you like this video, please hit the like button. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. All feedback is welcome and any feedback is good feedback. Please subscribe to my channel and check out my other tutorials. See you in the next episode of DIY by Sess. Thanks for watching! Yeah.